tail loaf. One thousand tail loaves. <laughs> Hello, it's Bows back with another video, and today, more mods. One of my modded playlists just hit 1,000 downloads. That's amazing. That means I have three modded playlists with 1,000 downloads because if you didn't know... Also, I'm playing Battlebox Theater if you didn't know that. <laughs> it's a game on Xbox. Anyway, if you didn't know, I have a playlist in S Solo Adventure. Down, 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 down. So many don't moves. Like, what is this? Anyway, it's called Mod Dash Solo, and it has 1,208 downloads and a four star rating. It's pretty good. I hear somebody talking through a mic. Anyway, that's besides the point. 1,208 downloads. I didn't really celebrate that because playlists in the solo adventure get downloads kind of quickly, so that's not like a huge milestone. So, yeah, I might celebrate like 3,000 downloads on that, so yeah. 2,000, 3,000, maybe something like that. But 1,000 downloads on a playlist that has not been featured and is just three adventure levels in the arena is something to me. Let's be real. I'm honest. Here. Nope, oh, didn't mean to do that. Anyway. I just... It's pretty awesome. Never been featured. Never... Never been. It's just like it's only three levels, you know. Like there's a playlist called Death by I Ate a Snack, and it's three levels, but it's been it, they used to feature a long time ago. Like I don't know how long ago, but like about two years ago or so, they used to feature any playlist it made in the arena as long as it was good. But now they kind of just feature arena playlists. I don't even think they feature challenge playlists anymore. But also, I have the most downloaded troll playlist, which is pretty cool. I think. I mean, I've never seen anyone have 669 downloads. But anyway, that's pretty good. So today we're going to do a little special thing here. Not super exciting since I've already done this. This has already been done before. Already, Three Mile Levels was the first one. That was pretty cool because that was my first playlist to reach 1,000 downloads. But anyway, I'm going to show you what a modded level looks like. So... I'm not gonna really like show like the most amazing thing ever, but I'm going to show the playlist I'm working on called Modded Dash Co-op. I'm going to show what it looks like with mods in it. So anyway, here's the playlist. Here's the level. Hear that? People. Wait, wait, but see it right there. See that little light? It's weird. Anyway, <laughs> it's not that weird. But anyway, this is a golden hat. It does not spawn in game, it's just a set location for it to spawn. So I'll test the level until it spawns eventually. Also, we have this. Ooh. You have to copy it and then you can like, place it everywhere and it looks like cool stuff. And if you put this here, it deletes it. It's cool. And then, you know, you got this modded background and then you got the, you know, we're in the, if you look right here, right there, it's um, all chapter 8 themes. You, know, you can see all the gems right down here, you know? Yeah. And then you got this and this. This horrible thing. Demonic. What's demonic about it, you might ask? Well, <laughs> that. It deletes blocks. So you can, like, delete these blocks on the side. I don't want to make a mess. Anyway, well, I got wrecked. Anyway, yeah, that's, there's not a lot of modded things in this stupid door. Anyway, I'm gonna go, you know, in levels, wait until a golden hat spawns, because, you know, it's cool. But anyway, we'll go into a different level, because this one is not that modded. So sad. It's called Modded Dash Co-op. Sequel. Not sequel. It's like, it's just a different type of thing. But anyway, so here we have another modded level. Now, how it works is, you know, you got these doors. You just copy them in place. It's a background-y kind of thing, so it doesn't really do much. Also... See that lamp right there? Can't copy that. Ah, ah, ah. I have to put it there in a special way. But anyway. You know, I got these lasers. Blah, blah, blah. And I know. If you touch them, you die. Of, you die of a death. I, I can't get up there. Stupid. There. Wait. Now. Now we die. Oh, no. 
No! Oh! I'm dead! Oh yeah, that's what they do. They're just lasers. If you're not familiar with this laser piece, it's like when a laser stops shooting, you'll see it for like a, for like a frame. It's just a very... It's a cool laser. So yeah, you know. I mean, it's a co-op, so I can't get up there. <laughs> and they got these invisible blocks. Well, this is the texture of them. Yeah. They kind of just are little red thing. I, I don't know what they call that. But anyway, it's like you place it down. It, it's, it's just so you can see it in the editor, and if you change it, you have the holy T-block. And the T-block I can't use in the editor. It basically is what I use in my modded trolls, so you can kill people, like throw grenades at them, but they... and hit them, but only entities go through it. You will not go through it. And you're kind of an entity, but you're not. You're a player entity, so you don't go through it. Well, you go through it. No, you don't go through it. All right. Anyway, it's pretty cool, you know. But it doesn't really work in the editor. You have to test it out of the editor. But we're not really gonna do that. And then you have the invisible cloud, which is the same thing. I mean, it's, an, well, it's a cloud, and you can't see it. So let me just uh, put a little spawn right here, so I can get up. And where is it? Okay, it's right here. Oh, I'm floating. Hacks. Hacks. No, I put an invisible cloud right there. Actually, if you put it right here, it makes it look like you can stand on the door. Whoa. Whoa. That's pretty cool. And, you know, I got the lamp and then this, you know. You can't change it. See? You can't really change it. Only You can only change the invisible blocks. See, it changes. I don't know why it does that. It's really weird. I guess it's because in the when the behemoth was making their levels, it just would it'd just be a lot easier if they were able to do this. Anyway, you got the golden hats. You know, probably aren't gonna spawn. I don't know if I'm gonna get one to spawn. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. They spawn in the editor, but they don't spawn in game. It's weird. I <laughs> see people talking. It's like, anyway, it's just. 1,000 downloads again! It's just amazing. But anyway, this is Invisible Blocks in action, you know? Ah! You know. Pretty cool. But that's pretty much all that level has to offer. I'm not gonna show every mod. I might in another video, I might not, but anyway. This is pretty cool. The key, if you've played in the... I can't copy it either. Yeah, it's like a key, you know, just touch it. No. Cat. I st don't do this. Bad. Touch it and it ends the level, you know? Woohoo! And then, oh, there's also a secret exit, which is actually used. They actually use this for, um, in lobbies and stuff. Oh. Oh, it's a secret level. <laughs> yeah, actually, there's a. There was a secret exit there, but when you step on it, it makes you disappear. I might find a level with that in it, but anyway. That's that level mostly, and then you got those special colored blocks for team colors and stuff you place down for fun. And then the one and only secret boss, which is a it's a black monster that chases you and tries to kill you. Yeah no. Oh no. Why am I in Soul Snatcher? Oh yeah, yeah. What what <laughs> No Stupid Anyway, tons of invisible blocks. Like see, here's an example. This lobby is using invisible blocks. Like this is what the chapter seven area looks like. They use invisible blocks. I didn't place some I didn't place like ninety percent of these down. But anyway. I did use like these were already here. These they use invisible clouds, yeah. They use all that stuff. I didn't place these either. I don't think. I don't remember. Anyway, that's that level. Secret boss, pretty cool. And then if we go to level five, you know, it's not much to hype over. There's this little tube tunnel thingy. But yeah, it's um got the gift shop background, you know. And then you got like stuff and things and junk. Number six is one of my personal favorites. And you got this tree. There's a cat right there. Can you hear that? It's a guy, it's a guy talking through his mic. Anyway, this is a co-op playlist, so I can't really um I'm gonna have to use an acid bowl. <laughs> well, that just, that just failed. Okay, how am I going to do this? I can do it. No, I can't do it. <laughs> Alright. I'll just remove the fan. I'm not going to save any of this, anyway. Stupid cat. Stupid. Anyway, this is uh, pretty cool. 
I'm not going to reveal how I do this because it's I don't want people stealing it. People have already stolen my uppercut pit mod and mod and that really frustrates me, so I'm not gonna let them get this their hands on this. At least hopefully they won't. But anyway, I got these dead cat look at his face. Ugh. He does not look happy. Yeah. That happened. I am horrible at this game. I don't know. It's probably just me. But anyway, go down here. Get over. <laughs> I just put the checkpoints. I'm just so bad at this. Maybe I should just fix it. It's like, oh yes, I did it. I had to put a fan here because you know noobs. Curses. No. What? Anyway, that's kind of all there is. Oh, secret exit. Need to show you guys that. It's right here. See that? See that little red thing? That is a secret exit. It kind of looks weird. But anyway, if you step on it, that happens. But, you know, you can walk on it. Like, you know, you stand here. Boop. And you cannot enter the enter the finale entrance. But, yeah, you can take it. Put it around. Woo! Got myself finale entrance. But there's some things you can't copy. You have to place it differently. Stupid! I forgot to take down this. Alright. Now the spawn is... No. <laughs> I'm just failing miserably. This is Epic Fails. Welcome to EpicFails.com. I'm joking. But anyway, I just spammed those everywhere. But anyway, we're not saving that. That's stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. This video can't be too long, by the way. I'm not I'm not going to get through probably this entire playlist. And you got this. It's just a little... Oh, oh. This is a modded item for sure. The hat... Wow, it's so shiny. If you touch it, you win the level. It's kind of just like a key, you know? There's a key right there, if you see it. It's right, right there. Anyway, I'm not gonna get too far into this. But anyway, you got like, you know... Let's do the finale, first finale. The first finale is just great. It's cool. It's one of the coolest things I've ever had. But anyway, you know, I got this little this guy right here. Ah, oh, it's, it's a foreground. That's called a foreground because it's in front. What is the opposite of a background? A foreground. Anyway, you know, it's just, this is mostly background and foreground modding. This That's what this level mostly is. You know, Hattie's chilling. There's a few mods in there, you know, but not much. Like, for example, right there, that's modded. And, you know, we got this finale, which isn't much to hype over. But here's another cool feature. Right here. It's a little door. Spam help. How fast can I spam help? Oh, I'm going to lose my energy for this video. Anyway, that is a door. Pretty cool. Anyway, that's that. And I will show you the secret level. It's pretty cool. Yeah, there's not a whole lot of mods, but yeah, you see you can't copy the hat. Yeah, I know. I'll beat this level, and then I'm going to have to end it, you know, because this isn't... as I Like I said, I've already reached this milestone before, so it's not like the most exciting thing in the world, but I mean, it is really crazy. I'll be honest. Oh, wow! I didn't expect him to do that. I thought he'd punch me. But anyway, nice move, Mr. Cat. But you're going to have to die now. Shoot your acid bubble. Nope, I missed. Oh, I thought that would kill you. Stupid. It's 9 plus 10. On that one. Oh! Meme it up in here. <coughs> Alright, anyway, I'm gonna end the video. Doesn't want I don't want it to get too long. But anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, thank you for another thousand downloads. I'm pretty happy about that. That's pretty awesome. Anyway, hopefully you can get um, the other playlist to thousand downs. That'd be oh, that'd be awesome. So anyway, I'll see you in the next video I create.